Hey everybody, this is Andy Flitter Grape. Uh, just a few minutes ago, we got finished with our wine-based cocktail. Right now, you know, we're gonna do our beer-based cocktail because we like beer too. We're gonna start off with um, Maker's Mark Bourbon, 46, really good bourbon. And uh, this is a Stone Peak Conditions Hazy Double IPA. Now this is a, a hazy beer-based cocktail. So really anyone will work. We do have this one in the store, of course. But um, also, you know, tomorrow night, uh, Danny is hosting Virtual Vines uh, with Stone. So please be sure to tune into that. Now back to the cocktail. Um, we're going to start off with our beer. Let's crack this puppy open. And of course, you know we have to taste that. So, all right, let's get started. So i got my tumbler here. Um, and like I said, any hazy IPA will do. Um, probably the more tropical notes, the better. This is a cocktail after all. But let's start off with three ounces or four, depending on you know, how much beer you want. This is a beer-based cocktail after all. So there is, I'm going to do three right there. Um, let's get that. Let's do an ounce of Maker's. There you go. Get to that in there. And remember... Um, we're gonna add some lemon juice, uh, lemon juice as well. I forgot uh, this. I just want to squeeze a little bit in there. Um, probably the more lemon, the better. I would say at least an ounce, um, half an ounce, one ounce. Uh, the lemon zest tends to cut through the um, uh, the beer, the head on the beer there. So uh, also it gives really good flavor. So and remember, from our wine-based cocktail, um, beer is carbonated. So we need to let that gas out a little bit. So we kind of stir that up a little bit. Let it sit for a minute. So if you don't, it will explode. And all that gas will just build up after you shake it up. Almost like a soda bottle, right? So that's kind of what we're doing. So you really, I'm going to do this faster than you probably should. Um, probably should let it sit for a while just for the video sakes. But let's do that right there. Let's get our top on. Get my glass ready. Got my ball of ice, and of course, we're gonna do a mason jar because we are in the south. Shake this up a little bit. Pour that. And there you go. And there you have it. You have the loaded hazy IPA.